cakes making a pose. His Tinder pose? Yes. That's, that's cakes Tinder pose. He wants to meet some kitties. Kitties. <laughs> And cats, welcome back to This Box is Lit. I'm Delilah, and I have with me today Miss Fiona and Mr. Cake. And together we are all going to open up the Winter Fab Fit Fun Box. So it's a little on the heavy and bulky-ish side, so I'm just gonna hold it up for a second um, because they fill it full of stuff. Now, this one is my favorite box to open because there are so many things inside and um, it's not just one type of thing. There are different types of, like I guess, lifestyle things or things for your house. Um, I've gotten jewelry in these boxes before. I've gotten a few cute like bathrobes and scarves. I've gotten lots of skincare products. Um, probably more water bottles than I need. So you can stop sending me those. Um, but aside from that, um, I have really liked pretty much everything that I've gotten in the FabFitFun box. Just too many water bottles. Um, I forgot to do the customization thing. Um, I'm supposed to, I guess, get notifications, but there was something weird with my app. So I didn't do the customization for winter. Um, so I have no idea what's in here. I've had that happen to me a couple of times in the past and... <clears throat> It's been okay. They, I've been fine with what they've sent. So um, let's get started. So FabFitFun is quarterly and it is $180 US for the entire year. I do it that way. Um, otherwise, I believe it's $50 per quarter. So they pack it right full. And I really feel like out of all of the boxes that I get, this one is a good one for pretty much anyone because they're, they have so many different um, types of things in here. And you can customize it, I just always forget to. So um, they have always a little guide that I can look at later. They always send, so they've sent this before, this is for the um, wine uh, the bright sellers, but it doesn't work for me in, in Canada, unfortunately. So this, that's no good. Um, they also send HelloFresh. I think that that works in Canada. So um, I don't know if it's the same type of offers. I'll have to maybe check it out sometime just to see how it works. Um, we got oh a sticker. And it says, add a little sparkle to your shine. And it's the, the little... Um, thing if you want to pass on along savings to a friend and okay here we go so this says below the belt I don't know this is oh it says it's a card case so I don't know that I would have picked this for myself but we'll take a closer look here it's it's a Pretty color. I do like the red. The cats seem to like it. Um, and it's the crocodile print. And it's just a little holder for your cards, your credit cards. And it's got this, I'm not really sure what you could put in here, maybe coins. Um, so that's good, I suppose, if I am just wanting to put something in my pocket, um, because usually I carry a giant wallet in my purse. So this uh, definitely, if I'm low on space, I can see this being useful, but I don't know about it for every day. Maybe if I'm at work going on my lunch break and I just need to like quickly take my cards, I'll find a use for it. All right. Okay, so this is a daily facial dry brush. And so I've seen these before. Um, 
I'll go ahead and take it out. I'm just going to say as a skincare person, I don't know, we'll, we'll see how soft this is. So I'm an esthetician and I see people with a lot of over exfoliation done to their skin. I don't know about every day, the bristles are pretty soft though, so you could probably um, give yourself a light exfoliation with it. But um, like my skin's pretty sensitive and I would get quite a bit of redness if I use this every single day. Cake likes it. Um, so I think this is something I might use maybe like once a week. And this is the Dr. Brandt Pore Purifying Cleanser with salicylic acid, tea tree oil, and white willow bark. So this looks like an, a pretty strong cleanser for oily to combination skin. Um, so it is a bit strong for me personally. My skin is combination, but as I've gotten older, it's become more on the dry side. Um, Let's, let's smell it. It smells all right. Like definitely I smell the, the tea tree oil, um, but it's not too strong. This is a, a pretty good brand. I do like the Dr. Brandt. So um, definitely it is something I could use during that the time of the month when I'm a little more breaky outy and have more like the redness on my chin, um, but not as an everyday cleanser, but this would definitely come in handy for people with oilier skin. So it looks like a pretty good cleanser. I use it with my brush. I think that would dry out my skin too bad, but like somebody else's would be okay with it maybe. Liquid eyeliner from Aesthetica. In black. I have quite a few of these from the many boxes I've gotten over time but I always I use them so it's in this kind of the little like bottle looking thing it's taken me a little bit to master the art of liquid eyeliner it can sense your fear that's one thing you have to go in and just be like you know what I'm gonna put this on, we're not gonna be scared, and I'm just gonna do it. Because, yeah, I've had like, oh, I'm gonna be late because it's all over me. Ooh. So these are Kate Spade socks. Let's take them out so we can look a bit more closely. They are the grippy socks, oh. That's weird. They're says so bar socks. What do I do with these? Are they oh are these like the little no show socks? Bear with me. So the cool thing about getting these mystery boxes is I get to try things that I probably would have never chosen for myself. I have no idea what these socks are for, but they're all like this. Like that. So I think maybe for when I'm wearing flats, and pants? I don't know. I'm gonna have to maybe, um, I know the guide that I put aside over here will tell me like what specifically is the best use for these, but right now I'm a little confused. But they gave me two pair and they have the little Kate Spade symbol on them. They feel like they would be pretty warm. So, I don't know. That's interesting. So 
So we've got something that looks like it's going to be soft and warm and cozy. It does feel soft. So this is Lucky Brand and it's a scarf in a nice solid gray. I don't have a scarf that's in just solid gray. So, but now I do. It's kind of weird with my hoodie. I don't like to wear scarves and hoodies, but I do like this. It's very soft. It feels like it's gonna be really nice and warm and it's gonna go with pretty much everything. So, yay, new scarf. All right, but wait, there's more. These are Sloan Champagne Flutes by Bomschby. Let's take one out. Try not to break any. So there are four of these in the event that I ever get to see more humans than just me and my husband one day. Those are cute. I don't have any glasses that are like this. So I like the shape. They're um, quite unique and yeah, looks like that would be perfect for a nice glass of bubbly, which I could use one right now. All right, I think this is the last thing that's in here. We have a cutting board set. And it's a Epere, Epere cutting board set of four. And they're different colors. I think we used to have a set like this at one point with the little pictures of the food on them. So I have kind of a really fancy, fancy pants cutting board. So I'm not sure yet what I'm going to do with these, but I'm sure I can come up with something, but they have all the, the four colors there. All right, so that is everything that is in the winter FabFitFun box. So I think that I could have done without these because I feel like we've given away these before in favor of a more fancy cutting board. Um, so I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do with these. Maybe, I don't know, give them as a gift to somebody. Maybe I'll do a give giveaway one of these days of all the stuff I don't want. Send it to you guys. We'll call it this box is shit. It's just like all the crap I don't want. Anyway, so yeah, if you ever get a mystery box from me, it may have these in there. We've got these. Um, I don't know that I would have chosen this for myself either um, because I do like the wallet that I'm currently using, but I can see times when something like this would come in handy um, when I need to just throw some cards in my pocket. Um, sorry, there's a cat in the way. Um, probably I could have done without this cleanser only because it's a little too strong for my skin. I don't know if that would have been part of the customization, but um, I'm definitely, I'm still going to use it just not as often as I would like a cleanser for my skin type. Um, I'm going to have to, whoa, don't knock over the, the glass cake. I'm going to have to look up how best these are worn. I'm thinking maybe with flats or something or some sort of like Mary Jane type of shoe, or I mean with the grippy at the bottom, maybe they're just more like a slipper. I'm not really sure. I'll figure that out too. And um, I've got my eyeliner that I can always use and my face brush and my champagne flutes that I'm definitely excited to use. What did you guys think of the FabFitFun winter box? Did you like it? Do you have questions about what's in here and what did you get in yours if you got the FabFitFun box? Be sure to leave that in the comments below and thank you for watching and please like and subscribe if you haven't yet. Thank you again.